Hi, I'm Avery, and today I'm going to teach you how to build any major scale using the lead or tenor steel pan. Now, quick disclaimer, there are many ways to think about music and music theory. This method is going to be more of a visual approach, so that whether you're playing or visualizing a steel pan, you'll be able to build major scales on the fly. So let's get started. Now, the magic behind this method really has to do with the layout of this steel pan. Due to the genius of Anthony Williams, the lead steel pan has evolved into a tangible representation of the circle of fifths. So if we were to start on the note C and count up a fifth, we'll find our next note. C, D, E, F, G. G, A, B, C, D. D, E, F, G, A. And so forth. Until you go all the way around the pan back to the note C. So let's take a look at a C major scale. This is one of the more easy keys to think about. And if I were to play a C major, on a C major scale on the pan, this is what it would look like. Now let's take a closer look at that scale. In fact, we're going to break it up into two, two pieces. The first piece would be the first three notes. So if we look at the first three, we have C, D, and E. By looking at the layout of the pan, we notice that for each note, we simply skip a note. Skip, skip. Next, if we look at the last five notes, <coughs> we simply start one note to the left of our tonic notes. following the same skip method. Skip, 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 leaving us to resolve on our home note, C. Now, with the layout of this pan, the nice thing is that we can simply memorize one pattern and shift it for it to work in a different key. For instance, if I want to move to a more complicated key, let's say E flat major, for instance, I can use the same pattern where I take the first three notes, skipping one each time, skip, skip, then I go one note to the left, skip, 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 leaving me to resolve on our home note. This pattern will work for every single key. For instance, E major. G major. And there it is. Well, there you have it. With a little bit of practice, you'll be able to easily build any major scale. So get comfortable with those. And when you're ready, click next to move on to the next lesson. See you soon.